Windows is one of the easiest to set up operating systems that you can use, including when it comes to administrative tasks. My name is Adullah, you're watching Ganero Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can block certain apps from communicating with the internet when using Windows. So the first thing that we're going to do is open up our Windows firewall or the Windows Defender firewall, however it appears on your PC and you will see this control panel window show up. Now we're going to click on uh, allow an app or feature through the Windows Defender firewall right here. Then click on change settings. And now we'll just quickly look to see if the app that we want to disable is in this list. So let's say I want to block my Chrome browser, but I don't see it here, which means we're going to have to create a, a rule for this to work. If you do see it here, you can just uncheck it and you'll be good to go. In any case, uh, if you come back here, click on advanced settings. Then click on out or inbound rules. Come here and click on new rule. Now we're going to select program here in this new rule window. Go ahead and click next. And now you have to enter the path to the program. So let me just quickly go and find the path for Chrome. So I'm just going to look up Chrome here. Right click, open file location. This should open the shortcut. So we'll do this again open file location and now I have chrome.exe so I'm just going to copy this file path and click on browse actually to see if it leads us there no we can just select chrome.exe here and now we're good to go so go ahead and click next click on block the connection click next again uh, we're going to block this on uh, all domains so domain private and public click next enter a name for it so let's say chrome blocker and then click finish so now if you as you can see i have an inbound rule uh, in my chrome blocker so this stops all uh, outgoing connections so if we go ahead and open up chrome and if i open up a website let's say the dot google.com click search and it still has access to the internet which means we also need to add an outbound rule in this case go ahead and click on new rule i'm going to go ahead program again click next program path uh, click on browse select chrome.exe again click next we're going to block the connection click next again make sure all three domains are checked click next again and call this chrome blocker outbound so all incoming and outgoing connections at this point have been blocked on uh, via our windows firewall this means that uh, chrome should not be able to connect at all to the internet so if i open the internet up again open up a new tab uh, let's do fast.com as you can see it's not really working anymore and we get this message your internet access is blocked a firewall or antivirus software may have blocked the connection so uh, that's how easy it is to block any program you can uh, instead of chrome you can select something else just make sure you create both inbound and outbound rules uh, because uh, outbound rules are the connections that go from out from your machine to the internet and inbound rules are connections that come from the internet to your machine so uh, if an app is both uploading and downloading or communicating with a server and you want to block it completely, uh, you can add both an inbound and outbound rule, making a blanket ban on all connections. If you like this video, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below if you'd like us to make more of these videos. If you'd like to know more about tech, visit our website candy.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter and we'll see you in the next video.